What's going on, everybody? My name's Chris, and welcome back to some more Let's Play Super SpongeBob SquarePants Pool. I don't know. Alright, last episode, we finished up Founder Hill, which I was terrified to do, but it actually went alright. And I was definitely like worried it was gonna take forever. Last time I did it, it took me like a long time, like half hour, 45 minutes. Yeah. In this episode, I'm gonna take on the legendary, the fabled. Sound Mountain! Oh boy. <laughs> Let's do it, I guess. I am terrified. Many terrified are within me. Oh boy. I don't know how difficult this is gonna be, actually. I remember having problems with the time trial. But the golden or the socks I'm not too worried about. I'm built for speed with this aerodynamic oh physique. No, that's not really aerodynamic physique at all. Beat my time. Bring it! Two minutes and twenty seconds. I ain't scared. Right. Bam! Yeah, I think that's the only way to get that. <laughs> for now, at least. Hmm. Hint, hint, nudge, nudge. Alright, so, let's go. Alright. Let's do it. I'm scared. Okay. So, all the slots I found are actually... You gain access by them by hitting the uh, trampolines. There's only like two trampolines, so that pretty much just goes to show. Hit the trampolines and you'll get socks. Ah! It's also not really hard to hit either, so it's kind of weird that they do that. Okay, there we go. These platforms are kind of funny too. They actually fall. It's hard to see, but maybe what, I'm gonna be coming back here with Sandy to get a sock in a bit. But maybe I'll. T I always sit back and watch them because I think they just eventually come back up. Oh boy, unless I just die. That's fun. That's very fun. Isn't it, Larry? At least I don't have to worry about dying anymore. Yeah, alright, well, we don't need to take that trampoline anymore, so let's just go down here. We shall go down here, and I'll show you guys this path. Whoa, isn't it so much cooler? No? Oh boy. Oh boy. It's downtown Bikini Bottom. Okay, I don't know why they would need to advertise that. It's like you would think that they would. Um, not need to advertise it, but that's where everyone needs to go anyways. Yeah, way to waste your money on billboards that don't even matter. Freaking square pants industries. Yeah, I don't know why it's square pants industries, but we'll pretend it makes sense. Okay, jump. Jump in. Ah, 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 do, 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 do. What? I hit it! Sure, I hit the side, and I mean, technically, I guess I wouldn't have gotten any bounce if this was a real world, but this isn't the real world, this is SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom! Alright, here we go. I'm gonna try my best to not miss that jump this time. Mm, it seems like it would be very hard to do a SpongeBob. What? Okay, that time I hit it! That time I did hit it! Come on, really? Really, game? Really? It's just, it's like teleporting me off. I'm the fast Oh boy. Are right, you guys ready? For the most epic of all trampoline bounces! There we go. Okay. So, hit this switch. And it kills some people. Oh, great. We gotta slow down a bit, apparently. There we go. There's a sock up there if you notice to the top left. We'll get to that in a moment. Right, hopefully, this thing did slow us down enough to our so we will lose. If you follow long enough, it hits that and destroys that. If you would have tried to just hit it, it would have broken. That's really freaking loud. I believe. Oh, we could jump down there if you want. I'm not going to. I don't know what's down there. We'll do it again later. Uh huh. That's the 60th. 60th. That means there's only 20 socks more in the game. Wow, this game's going by fast, guys. I know why I got a sour relaxing all of a sudden. But I bet. I bet. Is this a bad sour relaxing? I kind of feel like it is. I don't know, huh? Well, now I gotta do is finish this race. I get the feeling that boulder slowed us down too much. Pro plus, we did go on a different path there. I did miss another switch there, but not a switch we need. Alas, not the switch we need to do. Just because there's so many branching paths, it actually makes this race kind of difficult. Uh, let's jump down here. I believe the finish line just come, just about to come up here. Might need to go this way. Deal. What? Are you serious? I was holding right and he wasn't going right! Really, game? Are you serious, game? Good lord. Alright, let's go, Beeler. It's time I got freaking god dang it. Ah. Holy secrets! Alright, I guess we're back. <laughs> Hi, guys. <laughs> well, that was a. That was like even a shiny object there. I didn't expect that. I figured I'd be able to make that jump, but I didn't think they would 
thought that one out and thought the people were actually trying to make that jump. Yeah, all right, cool. Yeah, you lit that sand, SpongeBob. Okay, I guess we're back. <laughs> We've been back for a while. Let's go the other way that we haven't yet. Yeah, we're gonna have to go that way anyways with Sandy because there's another sock only she can get there. That's actually the last sock of the area once we get there. All right, there's some nice adorable tikis. Oh, cute. Okay, we already caught up to where we were before with that boulder. Is this gonna stay broken, I wonder? Yeah, yeah. No, nope, it does not. It makes the noises though, oddly enough. Oh, no, it doesn't. That's just those. Okay, that's kind of weird and really loud. That's what I was talking about. Like, they didn't really bounce the sounds this game too. What's that above me? You see that, guys? That's weird. Oh, God, I forgot about this. So the lines do give you a hint when you're gonna need to jump. But it can be annoying and obnoxious to avoid sometimes. <laughs> oh boy! Oh no! Oh, I made it. Okay, I think that's the end of that. Thankfully, that's kind of cool. Like that's something we've never seen before on these hills, and that's not a path that people. Well, I guess people would normally go on that. But it's like people's first instance to try is to try and find secret paths, even on the first run, right? Like that's always my thought when I play a game. I'll try going this way. We have only 37 seconds left? Oh, great. I think we go. Oh, maybe. What's this? Hey, right, I guess we're going this way now. <laughs> uh, see, I was going to try and go to the right, but it wasn't letting me. So I'm going to try again. Oh, there. Now it is. I think you might need to actually go this way to beat this. Because uh, this is the most straightforward path, I believe. We're going to do it. We might do it. Maybe. Oh, boy. Ah, it's so fast. Oh, my God. No. Oh, we were gonna make it anyways, but still. Oh, see, this is where this game becomes really freaking difficult because it's like I don't know how to beat this race. Oh, this is the hardest level, though, or at least the hardest hill. Not really the hardest level, but it's the hardest hill. All right, I'll see you guys somewhere. I don't that. really know where at this point. Well then, fuck me. Are you fucking kidding me? What the fuck? Oh my god, of course I would hit a Tiki. Oh! Yes, yes. Okay, we're back. This time we're gonna hit this and hopefully we can zoom along. Oh, okay, we don't need to pause for that, apparently. We're gonna follow it. This time we're gonna see where that. Because there's a purple shiny object there. We're gonna see where that takes me. Because I, if it's a shortcut, then that would be actually greatly appreciated. Let's take a look at this book. Yeah, you break that. Break that soldier boy! I know. Okay, let's go. Oh boy. What's down here? Nothing? Oh, what? I'll take it! I, I, I don't know if I was. I think I might have wasted too much time by falling on nothing there, but that worked. That's cool. Now I don't have a way to tell where to go though. I guess I do have the signs, but that'll be scary. I'll be too scary, man. Alright. <laughs> Go this way. 58 seconds. Oh, it's these turns. These turns. Freaking suck. Go here. Go there. Yeah. See, I don't know which way is fa Is it this way? It might be this way. I know there's a way that is faster than the rest. I feel like hitting these tikis is way too slow. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, there we go. There, it's right here. We have 35 seconds. You could slow down if you want to. Oh my good lord. Oh my good lord! Oh. I think I might have done it! Holy crap! I'm never gonna do this with this much time left. I'm normally just cutting. Whenever I've beaten this, I'm always just like barely being able to do it. What? You need to leave. Oh, great! No! Bad shot! No! Well, I was gonna say, if I die, I'm gonna be so mad, but there's like not a very little chance of me dying. If I do die, I will have to re. I will have to redo the race, but I'll have to get down here, which is annoying. It's because I would have activated the teleport box. Thank you. Uh huh. I don't have to worry about things are spawning anymore. Okay. What? Did I hit Chuck? Or was there two Chucks? There we go. Oh, they exploded themselves. What? I hear another one. Where? Hello? Well, okay then. That's weird. Or if we can see those weird things in the sky that I saw earlier. Um, I wonder. Stop giggling like a little buffoon, SpongeBob. 
Okay, because I saw weird things floating in the sky before. I don't know if it was a blue. Oh, they're right there! I guess they're just mountains in the background, but they're like just. They're floating there before. Okay, well, that. They're behind other mountains, so it makes it obvious that they are mountains. But before, like, there's nothing there, so it's just like they're floating mountain ranges or something. I don't know. Alright, jump in here. Congratulations, SpongeBob. You beat my yeah. Here's a sp Thank you, Larry. And with that, we've beaten Sand Mountain. And I'm really relieved. Because I believe this is my. Wow, look at Larry's face. <laughs> this is my least. Uh, my most feared area, actually. Uh huh. Alright, there we go. This fish looks high. Whoa. 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 Okay, sorry. <laughs> okay, we're done. Uh, actually, I don't know why I went that way for. I could have just exited the level. Normally. Well, let's go take a look. Let's exit the level as we normally used to. We do have some time left. Uh, in the next episode, we've actually completed the second area of the game 100% now. Uh, if you guys enjoyed, well, my game, Patrick, is socks, which we could get six golden spatulas. And really, technically, we could get all the... Um, golden specials from Mr. Krabs if you really felt like grinding forever, but we haven't we have yet to reach my favorite grinding spot in the game Oh, did it. Now I can go get my equipment and ski in peace You're dead Skidder, Actually, but I think okay. that Patrick borrowed your equipment. Uh oh What? Who said you <laughs> could do that? Me. I did. I figured if you didn't know you wouldn't mind again. Just wouldn't like mind. the of toothbrush. It's only the most expensive skiing equipment you can buy. And what does Patrick want with that stuff anyway? He doesn't even know how to ski. Oh boy. Oh, what the worm no? What? He wasn't even worrying. What? <laughs> okay, anyways, go back to the kitty bottom. And yeah, next episode, we'll enter the third area. And if entering the f third area is anything like entering the second area, it means there'll probably be a boss coming up. Probably my favorite boss in the game, maybe? Ah, not entirely sure about that. Anyways, till next time, I'll see you guys later. Peace.